time to jump back on board the 787. Economy class with LATAM from Sydney through to Auckland. It's only a short hop, but I'm looking forward to it. Let's go and do it. LATAM is a One World Alliance airline. So if you happen to be a Qantas Gold or Platinum frequent flyer, you can use the Qantas Business or First Class lounges, even if you're flying economy. If not, there are plenty of airport shops to keep you busy. <laughs> economy class on the LATAM 787 is laid out in a 333 configuration, giving nine seats across. I love the 787. It has much higher ceilings and bigger windows than other aircraft, so it feels lighter and roomier. Apparently the air filtration system is also better, so even your lungs will be happy on board this aircraft. It's a long way to South America, so it was good to see the seats were built for comfort. The leg room was pretty good, I could even cross my legs. The headrest is fully adjustable, which is handy for tall people, or if like me, your head flops all over the place when you sleep. There's a reasonable amount of recline, and as you recline, the base of the seat moves forward slightly, adding to the comfort level. These seats are fully wired, with in-seat power and a USB port, as well as individual seat back entertainment screens. Another good feature is the handy cup holder, so you don't have to have your tray down when you're having a drink. For the long haul sector between Auckland and Santiago, which is about 10 hours, each seat is provided with a blanket and pillow. So behind the scenes here, this is where all the work happens. And these are the great guys that look after you. The first hop to Auckland was only three hours. During this sector, a light lunch was served. It was okay, but nothing special. On the long haul sector to Santiago, a proper dinner and breakfast are served. Whilst lunch was pretty basic, it did come with a lovely glass of chili and red, served in real glass. Between meals, drinks are also included. Just ask the crew and they will provide. Of course, I went for a scotch and a movie. I liked the LATAM entertainment system. It was easy to use and the touchscreen was very responsive. The selection of movies and music was pretty good. The only negative was a rather basic route map. The thing that I love most about the 787 Dreamliner is the size of the windows. They are much bigger than all other aircraft and are positioned in such a way that you don't have to crouch down to see out of them. The window shades are electronic, so they darken by pressing a button. However, even on the darker setting, you can still look out of them and see the view. So it's really like the windows have put on a pair of sunglasses. It may be the plain nerd in me, but I reckon that's pretty cool. That was a fantastic flight. I just wish I was going all the way to South America. Rio, Iguazu, Machu Picchu love to go back to all of them. Unfortunately, I've got to do some work in Auckland here, but South America with LATAM is definitely the way to go. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up or leave a comment. Then check out my LATAM business class review and all the others on my channel. If you like those, please subscribe. I'm trying to get to 10,000 so I can tell my kids I've gone viral. Happy travels.